Here we're in for a good one. Michael Russell's going to start to serve. Mike Russell to serve. Love 15. Todd Martin making his intentions for the night. Pretty, uh, pretty certain on coming in there from the outset. Very clean hitter of the ball, Todd Martin. He's a very big guy, one of the tallest on the tour, and as you can see there, very, very strong. Pretty fair second serve there. Michael Russell gets on the board. Down 15-30. 30 on. As you would expect from someone of Michael Russell's size, he plays primarily from the baseline, and his big shot is his forehand. Advantage Russell. Though he was pretty effective with that serve, which was timed at 111 miles an hour. Gives him an add. Advantage Mountain. Another good serve from Mart or from Russell. Handcuff Martin. Advantage Russell. Very deep second serve there from Mike Russell. Forcing Todd Martin into an error. A lot of errors this first game. But Michael Russell's ahead now as an ad. Well, 
Yeah, it's a little bit uncharacteristic of both players, although Todd Martin will try to force the play. Uh, Mike Russell very consistent normally from the back of the court. Deuce. Possibly trying to push a little bit too hard too soon instead of settling down, getting a bit of rhythm. It's amazing. Seven unforced errors in the first game. That's both players combined. In one of the sets he played against Guga in Paris, he made two unforced errors in the entire set. And he surpassed that now with five. Finally holds. He leads one game to love. Love fifteen. Big serve by Todd Martin. The one 119 miles an hour does have a powerhouse first serve on him. That point set up from that first serve. Shorter return from Mike Russell and Todd Martin really pouncing on that. Wrong footing, Mike. Martin, solid player all round on all surfaces, done very well on the hard courts. Rebound ace surface down in Australia. And uh, has taken out a title in Barcelona on the play. 40, 30. Also, as we said, did very well in Wimbledon. One game apiece. One game apiece. Breathing a sigh of relief there. Peter, I think Todd Martin has reached the semifinals of three of the four Grand Slams. I think uh, uh, Paris is the only place he hasn't because he lost to Malavai Washington the year Washington played through and, and confronted Richard Krychek in the final. He's been a finalist here. Uh, obviously, then he's had to go through the semis, and the same thing in Australia. Yeah, that'll be right. He's uh, done very well in all the Grand Slams and taken out a couple of titles in Sydney, Australia. Seem to have settled in and now they're hitting the ball very, very sharply. Michael Russell up 30 love.
40 long. Wondering whether these guys have practiced together, Mark, in the last year or so because uh, they're both residing in Pontevedra now. Powerful there from Todd Martin. I wouldn't be surprised if they have played together because of the fact that Michael Russell's father is the caretaker of the ATP headquarters, which is at Ponte Vedra, takes care of the, the club, and of course Michael practices there, and so does Todd Martin. Big serve by Michael Russell. He holds and he's up two Russell games to one. Two games to one. Mark that Todd Martin's the, possibly the Phil Mickelson of the ATP tour. One of those guys that's come very close to capturing a Grand Slam title and not quite being able to do it. I, excellent comparison, Peter. I agree completely. Definitely has the ability. Well, you look at Mickelson's latest results, and uh, he was oh so close and yet oh so far away. And, of course, Todd Martin has been in a, several Grand Slam finals, I think three in total, and uh, just hasn't uh, been able to pull it off. Peter corrects me, and this overstated by one. He was a 94 finalist of the Australian Open, and also here in the 1999 championships when uh, he had all my money and uh, lost in a tight five set match to Andre Agassi a match that could have gone either way Forty fifteen. game it's two apiece two games over Over hitting that off forehand. Certainly does like that sh shot. We'll take a look at Tony Nimmons. 
chair umpire from US of A. I feel like Todd Munn's just not quite settled. Really sort of thumping a couple of balls where he's not really in position to make a great shot from. Seems much more impatient than normal. The first couple of games have far too many errors for these guys because they're usually very steady. Michael Russell's eighth unforced error. Wasn't a bad one to make. He was certainly trying to get Todd Martin right out of the picture in that point. a break point. <laughs> and Martin has the break. He leads three games to two. Martin leads by five games to two. pass from Mike Russell maybe a little surprised that it was up so high on him and over hit that forehand volley Big smash. Todd Martin. 15 on one. Timing it well. Getting balanced. Into the open court. Third. Service ace. Marcus third. Forehand by Russell takes the score to Deuce.
Russell has an ad. Just lost his serve to Todd Martin. Now has a chance to even things up. See, he really gets a lot of power out of that backhand. He gets it, at, even though it was up high on him, and he is a little guy. Certainly sort of gave that a bit of a nudge. But not quite timing that backhand. Oh, that's well played. Yeah, let's change of tactics here. Cut coming in, seven volleying. Could have put that backhand away, I feel, that backhand volley. Definitely putting it away there in the second one with the angle. Todd Martin seven volleying again there. Holding his service. Late for game. Leading 4-2. I'd be very surprised if you see Mike Russell serve Molly tonight. Obviously makes it a little bit tougher being a shorter shorter player to just don't quite have the reach. Russell actually served and volleyed a couple of times in Paris, and he did so against Guga, which uh, was very un Mike Russell like type play. Here he leads 30 15, though he trails in games, two games to four. 40 15. So Russell holds on, but Todd Martin leads, and he'll be serving at four games to three. Baseball, they call that a home run. That they do. Mike Russell slipping a little bit there at the back of the court. No real danger. Oh, 
13-15. Todd Martin's fourth ace. Certainly got a lot of angle off that serve there. Well, Peter, as you said, it's six-six, so he's got uh, a lot of height to hit down from. Very deep for him, Bolly. Forty fifteen. Just wondering how that right knee of his is holding up. He's had to pull out of a couple of tournaments leading up to this championships. an easy time of it. He holds his serve and he's up five games to three. Russell's second double fault. Fine play by Martin. Got a second serve, came right in behind it. Fifteen thirty. A little bit unfortunate there, the ball catching the tape. Perhaps trying to be a little too delicate. Russell was down 30 love and now he's back 40 30. Deuce. Serving his third double fault now. Not a good time for it. He's needing to close out this game to give himself an opportunity to break the Martin serve. Dip back on level terms in this first set. And he has an advantage. holds but Todd Martin leads five games to four so Mike Russell be trying to knuckle down here 
Get as many returns back as possible as Todd Martin serving for this first set. Leading five games to four. Crowd getting behind both players here. A little bit of encouragement. That's a good serve right there. Second serve, just swinging away from Mike Russell's body, but not too far away where he can actually have a free swing at it. Oh, superb shot. A very good backhand overhead there. Peter. Sorry, Sorry, Mark. Sorry Peter. Go ahead. Now you could see from that first serve there again, straight into the body of Mike Russell, enabling Todd Martin to get in close to the net and uh, the offensive lob from Mike Russell just not quite high enough. Thirteenth unforced error from Todd Martin, equaling Mike Russell, but Todd has 14 winners to Mike Russell's two. That's the telling point at this stage. down the line. 40-15 for Todd Martin. As fast as Mike Russell is, there was no way he was going to get that so deep into that forehand corner, giving double set point to Todd Martin. Yeah. And there it is. First yeah. set, Todd Martin, six games to four. Six games to four. Just a good point all around. Martin hit a very nice volley, and Russell hit a better shot. Yeah, this is a great shot down the line here from Mike Russell. And the guy that yelled out, yeah, was actually Todd Martin. Oh, and there's, there's one to match it. That's uh, very, very good, very deep. Skidding off the line, catching Todd Martin by surprise. I was trying to go for a little bit too much on that forehand. Again, unforced air off that forehand side. He's trying to do a little bit too much. The idea was right. He slowed his first serve down. Made a good first serve into Todd Martin's body, moving him around. Now he's facing double break point.
couple of good Martin shots, a couple of Mike Russell airs, and Todd Martin starts the second set by breaking Michael Russell's serve. He leads one game to love. Very nice lob. Yeah, very well timed. Shot of Mike Russell was very deep, but uh, being a shorter guy, it's obviously a little bit easier to to get the ball over, and uh, the target just seemed a little bit smaller. So. <coughs> A little surprise even Mike Russell advancing to the net there. See if Todd can consolidate his break. Of course, Todd Martin would n like nothing better than to run this set out, get on top in the third, and then close the door early. Michael Russell, on the other hand, is going to try and keep him out there till the sun rises. Played by Martin. He's up 30 love. He sees Mike Russell on the stretch. Comes in, plays a drive, forehand volley. That shot's certainly come into the game in about the last 10 years or so. A little surprising to see Todd Martin play that. Because he's got a very good forehand volley. Forty love, Todd Martin. Nice reach by Martin. And he now has a two love lead in the second set. He won the first set, six games to four. He's a big guy, he's tough to pass. But, uh, Mike Russell, probably a little unfortunate there. First serve was very good by Todd Martin and certainly got a good swing at that pass. Very ambitious second serve there. Light. Light. First serve. If he doesn't think the machine is off is working, we should turn it off. Man. It's just the it was operator. Is the machine working? It is working. I think so. Just checking about the cyclops machine that calls the service line. Fifteen. What do you think about those machines and Mark? I think they're a, a worthy thing, trustworthy thing, something you can believe in. Peter, you played much more recently than I did. I'm going to let you answer your own question. Because I think there are times when uh, they can be questioned. 
Yeah, they certainly do make Fifth errors. But, uh, to the human eye, we also make errors ourselves, so we can always blame something or someone. But Martin advances off that deep return, touching that four and volleying the open court. Peter, you aren't going to be a politician, are you? You sounded very political on that. You handled that very well. I'm uh, staying very clear of pol anything political. All right. Well, Todd Martin is not political, but he's off to a two-love 30-15 lead in this third game of the second set. Nice volley by Mike Russell. gap there for Todd Martin to make that pass but he did only just miss as you can tell here four or five inches Deuce. Another characteristic mistake from Mike Russell there certainly doesn't want to be down a double break this stage of the match. He's <laughs> a winner. May not have needed to go for shot so close to the line may have only just hit the line for that matter he's got the advantage great forehand from Michael Russell Todd Martin leads two games to one second set Todd Martin serving. I think that was even in the doubles court. I think that's a first for today. We haven't seen many of those. And Todd Martin is down love 30. If Mike Russell can get Todd playing another ball here off the serve, doesn't want to make any careless or easy errors. But it's a little bit tough off that serve. 110 mile an hour down the tee. Had to stretch for it, and Martin closed in pretty well there. He's not out of trouble yet. Same play again, only this time out wide to the back end. Easy forehand volley, the open court. You're right, Mark. I'm not sure why Todd doesn't serve and volley a little bit more. I guess against some of the better returners like Andre Agassi, even some of the Spanish guys, Juan Carlos Ferrero. 
40, may have a little bit more trouble, but uh, if he wants to get the job going, get it over and done with tonight, I think it's the right play against Mike Russell. Oh, I agree. Oh, that's a wonderful forehand. Are you with it? Todd Martin wins the third game of the Martin second wins. set. Three games to third. He's up three games to one. Should have said his third game of the third, second set. Big return. Said how clean Todd Martin hits the ball and how early he takes it. Really jumped on that that serve, second serve of Mike Russell's. Very surprised. 24 winners from Todd against the guy who runs a lot of balls down. A little too cute there. Back to your point, Peter. It it's just goes to show you how well Todd Martin is striking the ball. Thirty fifteen. It's Michael Russell's first ace. Taking that ball so early. Doesn't really give Mike Russell much of a chance to get himself in position after uh, serving. Let alone getting over across to the ball. A little bit of aggression taken out there. Give him game point. Oh. Good first shot. Dodgy on the second one. Michael Russell holds serve, but he trails. Todd Martin, three games to two in the second set. It's like Mike Russ has got his bridge stones on there. Covering the court, putting in a slide. The point set up very well by Todd Martin from that first serve. He really gets a lot of angle out wide there. It's Todd Martin's first double fault. He has three aces. Setting up that point. 
Could have done a little bit more with that backhand volley. I was thinking the same thing, Peter. Pretty relaxed volley, but still the overhead was punishing. A little bit of a miss hit first serve. No mistake with a second, but Mike Russell making the error. Todd Martin ahead, 40-15. Looking to go up 4-2. And he does with his fourth ace. It's far a very comfortable match for Todd Martin. Yeah, well, he's got his rhythm set, that's for sure. I mean, he's made a few uncharacteristic errors. But being up a break in each set, I guess you... Uh, maybe he's either going for a little bit too much, but got Mike Russell serving now with new balls. And Todd will be trying to... Really get on top here. But not before Mike Russell gets on top of that smash. A little bit too short here from Todd. Russell up 30 love. Very clever second serve. that fortunate thing for Mike Russell he does have another two game points Michael Russell and he holds serve but trails four games to three second set. Todd Martin serving he's ahead four games to three. Right. First serve. in that point a couple of slice back ends from both players Fifteen on. Well, that must have been very tight probably didn't need to go for quite that much that back end just being inside the line Great outside serve. Peter, we've seen that a lot in the first two days of the, the tournament. Uh, women are using it more, and the men, of course, uh, 
using that very effectively that wide swinging serve particularly on the forehand side. Well again a lot to do with the surface I'd imagine. But, uh, it is good to see that the girls are bringing slice serves into their repertoire a little bit more now. It certainly takes your opponent right out of court. Another wide serve and another one successful for Martin. He holds, he's up five games to three. Martin leads five games to three. Rafter used that serve very effectively on the backhand court or on the second court, kicking it very wide, but keeping getting the ball very short up the sideline. And the ball moves away. Very effective. Oh, just a spanky return there by Todd Martin. Change of pace there from Todd Martin. The last two shots he's played a lot higher over the net. A little bit more loop and not as hard in pace. Giving himself an opportunity here. 15. Fine serve by Michael Russell. That's the right way to answer back. Gave that one a pretty good ride for a guy who's five seven and a half. Yeah, 118 miles an hour. Thirty. Mike Russell quite a way back behind the baseline as well. On these rallies. Fourth double fault for Mike Russell and set up a break opportunity for Todd Martin for a double break, which would give him the set. Oh, that's a nice pass. Martin did the right thing, came in behind Davis. the second serve, but Nets stymied his shot a little bit, and Michael Russell responded. That's good timing for Mike Russell. Ball did catch the top of the tape, came through pretty thorough, but it can be a little bit off-putting. Advantage, Russell. He's staying in here at the set with a chance. Oh, that's yeah, it. Yeah. Off backhand, Michael Russell holds serve. They change ends, and Todd Martin leads five to four. Will be serving for the set. Have Todd Martin serving for the second set. Running from Mike Russell. 
making up to this ball here wasn't quite short enough for Todd Martin of Likings. Threading the needle down the line, even though Todd was there, it was a very tough volley to play. Big serve. Carries it to 15 all. Decisive by Todd Martin. And with that volley, makes it 30 all. Gives him a set point. Also his sixth ace. You can put an M on the second set because Todd Martin has won it 6 4. He also won the first set six games to four. Michael Russell will start the third set. Russell takes the first point to start the third set. And then gives it right back with a double fault. His fifth of the match. This game of the second set, Todd Martin made his march, taking the break. Certainly got a little bit of a sniff here. Oh! Must have been just wide that call. Oh, that's nice. He's jumped on that short second serve, seized the opportunity. Coming forward, very nice volley there, staying low. He's got an easy one there right into the open court. Not enough put on that pass. So 15.40. And the second serve. Just like the second set, 
Todd Martin jumps all over That's second serve and he breaks and is ahead one to nothing. It's third set. Michael Russell's carried on a very interesting conversation on the changeover again. We don't know if the audience heard it. He said something to the effect you wonder why tennis is dying. Michael I don't think it is. It's doing quite well as a matter of fact matey. It's probably just frustration Peter. Could well be could be relating to the. Uh spectators and not a not a lot out there at the Louis Armstrong Stadium tonight. There is a big match on the stadium court. Arthur Ashe. The young gun Andy Roddick. Oh. That's sure. big, 121 mile an hour. Not quite his fastest serve for tonight. But he certainly comes down with a bang from the towering Todd Martin. Just short of two meters tall. Maybe should get a spike haircut and he'll uh, get the measure. Interesting point. Todd Martin with a couple of slices changes the speed of it, then comes through, and finally Michael Russell gets a little impatient, drives it wide. Todd Martin's seventh, excuse me, third double fault. He's got seven aces. Overran that ball a little bit. Got it close into his body. Michael Russell has a break point. Only his second of the match. Well, he needs to do something. Now's the right time for it. Great opportunity here. Been very close. Mike Russell knows he let something go there. Brave move, Todd Martin coming in. That approach wasn't all that deep. Smart. Again, Martin serving wide. Advantage Russell. Russell reading it. Seeing Martin struggle down the back, comes in. Slide volley. Playing short. What you call that? The bridge stones? Could be the bridge stones on there. Well, 
disappointed there. He got himself out of trouble. Back Do into this. a little bit of a commanding position for that point. Just making a point there that's a game of inches. That ball just catching the tape. A lot of frustration. The young American. Good shot by Russell, and it's back to Deuce. Deuce. It was effective. He doesn't necessarily need to go for too much on those passes. I mean, that one there dragged uh, Todd Martin forward a little bit more with that pace taken off it and causing the error. And advantage to Martin again. Peter, I think this is the longest game of the match. Would be so far, yeah, Mark. Martin being down a couple of break points. And uh, as you say, now has game point. Very loose shot by Todd Martin, and we're back to Deuce. <laughs> we'll put that one in his Christmas hamper. A very good drop, Russell. drop shot from Todd Martin, especially against a little speedster like Mike Russell. Got himself another break point. Yep. Oh, there you go. First break for Michael Russell and we're back even, third set, one game apiece. One game one more. Yeah, I think Todd Martin hesitated after that. It was a very good first serve. Had Mike Russell very much stretched onto the backhand side. I think, see there, Todd hesitated. I think he could have came in and played a volley, or at worst, maybe pulled that forehand down to Mike Russell's forehand and uh, left himself pretty much in no man's land. Todd Martin returns to being the aggressor and wins the first point. Third game of the third set. Good 
depth by Martin. Russell's down, Love 30. Gets one of the points back. Makes it for so much off their back end. Mike Russell would be happy about that. <laughs> Not too happy about that. Scrambled very well, covered a lot of court, but saying goes, if you're going to get there, you've got to make it. Enabling another break point for the set for Todd Martin. Take a 2 1 lead. Trying to vary the pace, just being a little bit careless. Maybe not picking it up that well. Slicing it wide. Deuce. Ball got onto Russell awfully quick. And as a result, he makes an error. Deuce again. So gets an ad. Game to Russell. Game to Russell. He holds and leads two games to one. Russell leads two games to one. Third set. And uh, the unforced errors. Nearly even, 23 for Mike Russell, 31 for Todd Martin. But again, the win is definitely outweighing in favor of Todd Martin. So Todd Martin starts off serving. Fourth game of the third set. He's up 15, love. And his eighth ace.
much better service game than the last one. Seems his, his rhythm seems a little bit better. Yeah, possibly just refocusing here on concentrating, reconcentrating again because he got that early break <laughs> in the set. Let it slip by. Of course, I say that, then he slaps a backhand long. Probably should never praise a player <laughs> when when they're serving or they're doing something very good because then it always there we go another service ace is ninth and Todd Martin holds makes it two games all two games in the game. third set Michael Russell's sixth double fault. Clever play from Todd. Not trying to do too much with that short forehand. Just placing it very deep into the corner. Oh. That could be very costly, that mistake there. Gives Martin a break point. Peter, it's interesting. The last time he went for one of those and made it, you said he'd gone for a little too much, and so he tried to repeat it and fell short on this one. Oh, that's nice. Deuce. Martin almost hit that like he hoped. He, he, he stuck it a little bit, but it wasn't very deep and pretty ordinary shot to try and come in behind. Yeah, well, most of Mike Russell's passes have from the backhand side have gone cross court, but on that occasion going down the line and maybe that's the side Todd Martin's favoring on that knee. And not able to push off one. and uh, chase. But, uh, he's got another break point here. Mike Russell in real danger. his fourth of eight break points and he's ahead three games to two. Todd Martin serving leading three games to two.
going to stand on his knees to play that smash. Strong second serve, though. Fifteen. Mike Russell looks like he could go about another nine sets. If he keeps making passes like that. He get another couple of sets, but he's still got a bit of an uphill battle here. He's yet down a break. So there's still hope for Mike Russell. Uh, Michael Russell wins his second. Of five break point opportunities and brings the score to three all third set. Peter, four service breaks in a row. A little bit uncharacteristic of uh, the men's tennis game Absolutely. these days. Point side to side, getting the big man to move. But uh, do you see any real game plan that Mike Russell has here tonight, Mark? Peter, I think it's simply he's going to outlast him. He certainly hasn't been able to outpower him, and uh, Scott Martin's game plan is obviously to hit with power but get to the net. Wondering if Mike Russell did have something set in his mind as what he wanted to do, other than just try and outlast him, because it ain't so easy. It ain't as easy as it seems. That was inter interesting. He Opened up the court with a forehand, stayed back, and then came in on a ball that was was very difficult shot. Yeah, you can see there he's just off the back foot, trying to approach there, and getting caught. Michael Russell up, 40-15. Court forehand, a little bit too much power for Mike Russell. Still got game point. 
Todd Martin just tailing off at the back. to possibly play a high floating ball back try and get as deep as you can and get yourself back in the court He was chomping at the bit there, just tried to go for a little bit too much again, and the ball not even really getting up the net. Letting Mike Russell back into this game. <laughs> that shank forehand return is giving Mike Russell opportunity to take this game, get back on terms, and lead 4-3. up 4-3 in the third set. Russell leads four games to three. It's a good start for Todd Martin. He's 15 love. They're the points that he'd, he'd be wanting to try and get on return. Keep him short and sweet. Todd Martin doesn't pull his socks up here. He's going to find himself going into a fourth set. 15-30 down. A couple of errors. And Mike Russell's very much in the hunt. Very eager. Very hungry. This set. the game carries the score to 30 all
gives him an advantage. Makes it four all three set. Todd Martin holds serve. That's a good thing he got a couple of big first serves in there. He was in a little bit of danger. It's a sign of a good player. That is what Todd Martin is regarded as. The points that Todd Martin doesn't really want to be losing. Especially at this latter stage of the third set. Fatigue setting in. It's a young fellow that's ready to chase down anything. Michael Russell is in Russell territory, as it were. He's fitter than fit, just keeping balls going to come back, and Todd Martin's going to have to gear up, or he's going to be uh, in big trouble because we're going to be in a fourth set shortly. Gets one of them back, or I should say, one point against Russell's serve. Russell leads 30 15. And returns the favor with serve return wide, Russell 40 15. That would have been a very difficult volley for Todd Martin to play. Ned Keller just popping it up and basically leaving him in no position to get that ball back. Todd Martin on flat footed, or basically guessing at what he could be doing from there. Games to four, third set. Russell leads five games to four. Time being called by Tony Nimmons. 
for Empire. Todd Martin coming out. And Nautilus match 5 all. Third set. Leading two sets of love. Crowd building up a little bit more again. Uh, certainly is. Well, you watch a player like Michael Russell, and Michael Russell's a gamer. He is just real solid. A huge heart. Poor decision by Todd Martin, and it cost him. Level two. Down. On a service game. Deeper into the four end corner, and enabling Mike Russell to get a racket on it, even. It's the only way for Todd Martin to win this from here is going to be to serve it out. With a lot of big first serves. So once he gets into rallies, Mike Russell's pretty much in full control. As you say, having said that, that's that's the first mistake by Russell off the ground in quite some time. Just missed that backhand. Todd Martin was very fortunate on that one because uh, a couple of centimeters and uh, would have been Michael Russell's point. Instead of 40-15, we would have been back to 30 all. But it is 40-15. Wild second serve from Todd Martin that nearly hit Mike Russell on the shoelaces. Still with a game point. Wouldn't want to let him back into this game. Five games on. Just over two hours. Todd Martin, 32nd. 32nd seed here. The new system of seeding 32 players. Strong. I think he's done something to his knee. Exactly. Yeah. Love 15. Slipped there at the middle stage of that point. Perhaps jarred his right knee, or maybe could have even done a little bit of muscle damage. Still going on with the job. Something to do with Achilles, maybe. With his left foot. Yeah. Oh, he's not holding 
back on these ground strokes. Senses victory. Come up a little bit short there. Russell on serve, getting himself pumped up. Todd Martin, and get a little bit of adrenaline pumping, sensing a little bit of an opening here. That shot was on. Very difficult to play from that position. He knows it. But if it comes off, then it's what you call a very brave and good shot. But nevertheless, it's 30 all. has a great point. Peter, this may be the match right here. Well, it's probably the most important point of the match, especially in Michael Russell's standings. up six games to five third set so here we have Todd Martin serving six five thank you take out this match move through to the second round face Spaniard Tommy Robredo From Todd Martin. He's up 15 love. 15 love. away from this match. Todd Martin forcing the issue, attacking at every chance. He wants to get himself into the locker room. Two more points and he will.
Todd Martin. Two hours and 13 minutes. Six four, six four, six four, six four seven, seven five. five. Well, he'll be happy with that mark to get the job done there. Still taking just short of two hours, 15 minutes, but to finish a match in straight sets in, the, in these early stages of the Grand Slam is what these guys really want to do.